Good morning. It's Thursday, and I'm going to bring our devotion today. I'm so glad to be back in the office and uh, been out for a couple weeks with this COVID stuff. And so I'm glad to be back today. I'm going to share with you from Luke 15, uh, verses 8 through 10. It says, Or suppose a woman has ten silver coins and loses one. Doesn't she light a lamp, sweep the house, and search carefully until she finds it? And when she finds it, she calls her friends and neighbors together and says, Rejoice with me. I have found my lost coin. In the same way I tell you, there is rejoicing in the presence of the angels of God over one sinner who repents. Um, I don't know about you, but I, ha I know I kind of I could I can relate with this woman because I'm gonna tell you as a single mom with four teenagers, that coin would have meant a whole lot to me, and I would have searched a, a great deal. I don't know what the value of that coin is in uh, comparison to what our money would be today. But I do know this, it was valuable enough to her that she sought till she found it. And it could not be replaced. It was valuable enough to her, she had to search for it till she found it because there was no replacement for it. Um, I believe that's exactly how God seeks us. He seeks us because he loves us so much that I, you know, I'm, I'm irreplaceable. He sought me till um, it wasn't where I was or how far he had to go to find me. It was about who I was and that I could not be replaced. And the value of that to him, I, I just, uh, I'm just i overwhelmed with the fact that he loves each and every person that much. And that um, and then the rejoicing in that comes after that. I mean, the, the salvation, it's always, there's always a reason to rejoice whenever we find something that we've lost. Uh, I don't know about you, but I got lost as a kid. I know the pastor was sharing that Sunday in his message uh, in a store one time. And buddy... I don't think I've ever seen my mom any happier when she found me, but uh, I, I was actually hiding them on purpose, y'all. I ain't gonna lie. But uh, nevertheless, um, we, I, I love that we have a Savior who seeks us out, and, Lord, and then we can rejoice in the salvation that he loves us that much. My prayer for you today is that you rejoice in your salvation if you've accepted Christ as your Savior. Know that he loves you so much that he sought you out no matter how far he had to go to find you because you are valuable and you are irreplaceable. Have a great day.